Picture this. You're standing in a running shoe store, holding two different shoes in your hands and looking between them. One is both out of your budget and above your skill level, and the other one isn't leveling up. Well, we've both been in that scenario and it's honestly quite frustrating. Well, the latest evolution of New Balance Fuel Cell Propel delivers premium technology at an affordable price. Welcome to Wild Air Sports. I'm Nadia Ramula, and in this video, I'm going to share some details about the brand new shoe from New Balance, unpack some of the construction technology, share some of our first thoughts and impressions, as well as who we think this shoe is for. First up, let's dig into some of the details of the Fuel Cell Propel V4. As for the purpose of the shoe, it's good as a daily trainer or race shoe for faster running at a great price point. The shoe is constructed from dual fuel cell foam layers with a TPU plate in the midsole and avoid to enhance energy storage and return. This makes the shoe quite light, with the men's shoe coming in at 289 grams and the women's shoe at 229 grams. They're both on the lighter end of the scale, but not quite a fully fledged speed or race shoe weight. The stack height or drop is 6 mm and designed for natural runners, so not really a stability shoe for pronators. The width is a standard D and B for both men and women, which is around a medium fit. All of these features come in at a great price point of 2,500 Rand. The key differentiators from the previous version is an extra layer of foam, a TPU or thermoplastic polyurethane plate, which makes it significantly stiffer in the forefoot, as well as an added rocker. New Balance seems intent on almost completely overhauling the Propel V4 with changes to the forefoot, midsole and overall aesthetic of the shoe. The biggest changes are the increased rocker, TPU plate to the midsole, added void or space that complements the TPU, also found in the Elite range. So how does all of this translate to a better run? The TPU plate in the V4 is wedged throughout the midsole of the shoe and can be seen in both the side panel as well as the outsole of the shoe. This makes for greater energy return as the shoe is stiffer in the forefoot than the V3. As for the void in the midsole, this clever design feature helps the TPU plate transfer, store and return energy to your stride. Essentially, the void allows the TPU plate to flex down more and return your energy instead of having it being lost into the foam and ground. This also gives you a softer ride as the sole gives way to the impact of the step instead of packing up. As for the additional rocker, that will just ensure that the shoe rolls more effortlessly on the outsole and propels you forward into the next stride. The upper mesh of the V4 is soft, light and breathable and actually feels rather premium. All in all, the combination of all of these changes are going to leave you with a softer and more energetic running experience. Ever heard of the idiom, got a pep in your step? After succumbing to the sudden urge to hop around on one foot, I found that they're indeed springy and energetic. The shoe feels stacked and cushioned, which is a stark difference to my usual trail runners. They're comfortable as walking shoes, though you might find yourself pacing around because of the added rocket to the forefoot of the shoe, which unconsciously drives you forward. The foot of the shoe is quite snug, but is not too wide or too narrow. My foot does not feel restrained, but my toes are able to wiggle and spread. My first impressions of the shoe after some running are pretty positive. I unintentionally and unconsciously ran faster than I intended. The shoe definitely delivers with energy return in each stride thanks to the extra cushioning, which also makes you feel like you can run a longer distance. The New Balance Fuel Cell Propel V4 is versatile and comfortable. It bridges the gap between daily trainer and racer, making it a solid option for those who want premium technology without breaking the bank. We really dig how this colorway hints at some of New Balance's more premium models, and it's also just a great shoe to walk around in if you enjoy having the proverbial pep in your step. Note, the men's shoe also comes in an orange and black colorway. The Propel V4 definitely caters to everyday runners who are looking for more than just an entry-level shoe without splurging on an expensive pair. The fuel cell layers makes for a comfortable run and means you'll be able to do more mileage where the TPU plate will help with fast leg or tempo training sessions. The shoe will shine best in the 5 to 20 kilometer range at both moderate to faster paces. If you're someone who enjoys a soft cushion shoe, enjoys a good heel stack and appreciates a smooth fast ride, then this is probably the shoe for you. 
the New Balance Fuel Cell Propel V4 is a great package and we hope you enjoyed watching this video with us. Subscribe to not miss more from Wild Air Sports and join us in our world at wildairsports.com.